This is ANN News Brief. Good afternoon. I am Roti Mia Kintunde. Egypt says its security forces have killed 10 militants involved in a bombing that targeted the convoy of Alexandria's former security chief three months ago. The Interior Minister's Ministry said on Thursday that the 10 were killed in a shootout in Behira province while two others were arrested. The ministry statement did not specify when they occurred. It says the militants belong to the Asm movement, a group it considers to be a splinter of the outlawed Muslim Brotherhood. The officials survived the convoy attack, which killed two police. A London-based nurse has been convicted of trafficking five Nigerian women into Germany to work as prostitutes after subjecting them to voodoo rituals. Reports say Josephine Yamu forced the women to swear oaths to hand over money to her during the rituals. She was convicted of five court counts of facilitating travel for sexual exploitation at Birmingham Crown Court. Yamu is the first person to be convicted under Modern Slavery Act laws passed in 2015 allowing prosecutions of British citizens for overseas sexual trafficking. We will return after this message from MTN. Are you sure you want to do this? Adam, go and bring us your husband. Okay, hello baby. We're in this together, okay? Can you hear me? Keep coming forward. Wait, 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 stop, stop. <laughs> you okay, Liz? You alright? <laughs> Keep walking now. Keep walking to the left. Yes. You're almost here. Keep going. You are here. <laughs> wow, you did it. I'm just so glad I didn't have to use my cane to do this. And I am so glad no other man got you before me. Let me be your eyes. We will never stop working to give you a network you can rely on so you can enjoy life's special moments. MTN, everywhere you go. Didier Drogba says African football has suffered a big step back after Senegal's exit sealed the continent's worst World Cup showing for 36 years. Analysts say Senegal became the first team in World Cup history to go out on the fair play rule after losing out to Colombia. Egypt, Morocco, Nigeria and Tunisia had already fallen at the group stage. The former Ivory Coast striker said, quote, Africa is going to be successful one day, but we need to think again about how we approach these big competitions, end quote. No African team has advanced beyond the quarterfinals of the World Cup. In Russia, African teams have managed just three wins and lost 10 in 15 attempts. That's ANN News Brief. For more details on these and other stories, visit our website, annafrica.net. You can also join the conversation on Twitter and Facebook at ANN Africa TV. I am Rotimi Akintunde.